Hello, welcome back to the C programming tutorial videos. Uh, in this video, we are going to see how to get the system time in the standard format as well as the GMT time format. So, in this program, we have the usual header files. We are using the usual, usual functions which are all prototype in stdio.h and conio.h we have included one more header file that is time.h time.h is a header file which defines which uh, defines the prototypes for the time related functions ASCII for my timing clock timing c time time difference between gm uh, between two timings time differences if you want to find the differences between the two timings GMT time. So most of the functions related to time and we have some data types size t, time t, daylight, these are all some variables, constants and data types defined in this header file. So in the main program uh, we have one variable declared uh, t and the size and the type of the variable is of time underscore t. This variable Type defines the value used for the time function. Okay, time t is a variable. Uh, mostly, it will be of a structure type variable which can hold the different values within a time data type. So here we have uh, defined a variable of time underscore t. So in the time we will be having date, month, year, time and all seconds, hour. All those details will be there. To store that we are using this variable. So clearing the screen with the help of CLRSCR and we are using a function time. It's a function to get the time. So uh, we have time function here. Time gets the time of day. The particular uh, instance time will be taken from the system and it will be stored in this variable t which is already of the time uh, of the type time underscore t and here we are uh, here we are printing the current time in the standard format so my local time is going to be displayed here uh, in this print of and it is printed in string format so the output from the c time function is going to be in string type character array or uh, character pointer type so for that we are using a function called aac time ascii time converts data uh, sorry date and time into ascii format so the time data type and the data data time are to be converted into some data type uh, better in string data type so that it can be easily printed on the screen using a print of statement and the print gmt time so for that we are using another function called gmt time gmt time converts the date time into greenwich mean time GM, gmt standard time so difference uh, uh, will be taken and that will be converted into gmt standard timing and that also converted into ascii time format converts the date and time into ascii format so that it can be printed so we can use C time for converting time uh, into ASCII and ASCII time function also, AAC time function also can be used to convert from time uh, type to string format and, can, and we can print it out. So C time converts date and time into string format and ASCII converts date and time into ASCII format. So both are two functions but both are more or less similar because ASCII character array that is character array itself and in C character array is nothing but a string and there is no string data type we are using character array so both the functions are more or less similar uh, we are using these two different functions in the two places to make use of these functions for our experience okay this is a program to get the system timing and that will be printed along with that we are going to 
get we are going to calculate the GMT timing from the time the present time and that we are printing ok let me run this program and see current time is Tuesday August 2nd 2011 and this is the current timing of my place I am in Indonesia GMT time is Greenwich mean time so there is a time difference about 3 to 4 hours between GMT mean time and uh, the time in my place so GMT time as well as the time the local time both the times are displayed with the help of this program so in this program we are especially using a function called the time to get the time from the system to storing it we are using a variable t of the type time underscore t this data type as well as the time function c time function a c time function which are all defined in time dot which are prototyped in time dot h header file c time is to convert into string format or character array format ascii time is used to convert the time into ascii format so this is a, a program if you want to get the timing system timing and if you want to do some programs by using the system time i hope you have enjoyed this video you try the program by yourself and if you have any doubt regarding this program or anything in general about c programming please feel free to write to me this is my email id it underscore teacher one at yahoo.com thank you for watching this video have a nice day